GC. I'm Tamia Fair here with Chris Snowy. Indie Girls trying out for softball this February need to attend conditioning on Mondays and Wednesdays. It will start today and go from 3.30 to 5.15 each day. DECA students who would like to compete in the February 3rd conference at MSU need to pay their $30 conference fee to Miss McKee no later than Friday. Ceramic students need to pick up any ceramics projects by next Friday or they will be thrown or given away to clear space for the new class. Madison Sullivan shares details about our big win of a Kraken during the break. Lindsay and Ryan show how to return a library book. Hey GC, last night our Lady Eagle and the Eagle basketball teams competed in regional rivalry games as they traveled to McCracken County to play the Mustangs. The Lady Eagles blew the game wide open in the second half with our Lady Eagles knocking off the Lady Mustangs 59-39. Alyssa Bernard had a double-double with 22 points and 10 rebounds. Good job ladies. Our Lady Eagle, our Eagle basketball team rebounded from their three game losing streak as they knocked off the Mustangs 49 to 38. Chris Vogt led the Eagles with 15 points. This is the first time in school history that we have beat the Mustangs. That's all for today in Eagle Sports action. For GCTV, I'm Madison Sullivan. Have a great day, GC. Do you know how to return a book to the library? Well, if you don't, there are a few ways that you can return them. The frisbee toss, the softball toss, the over toss, the under toss, the sneak, slide, and crawl toss, the side toss, the basketball toss. Please remember to return your books and make sure you do it the right way. Here's how. For GCTV, I'm Ryana Tips. Seniors, Mr. Bob Farr will be in the cafeteria starting January 15th to take measurements for your cap and gowns. He will be here at 7.30. Girls Soccer will have a meeting tomorrow after school in room C22. This includes all interested players, new and returning. Friday morning, you will go to homeroom to get your progress reports. GC Baseball is having their annual chili supper January 16th at 5 p.m. in the cafeteria. They will serve chili, hot dogs, sandwiches, and drinks. Tickets are $5 and can be bought from any baseball player, Coach Ford, and at the door. SCCLA members, report to the gym during SSR on Friday for club pictures. Wear your club shirt. Any student who isn't currently enrolled in 10th grade and is at least 15 years old by March is eligible to apply for a summer camp designed for a student who is interested in a healthcare profession. Students will participate in a variety of clinical settings. If interested, see Ms. Rogers in the guidance, counselor, guidance office for more information. There will be a beta club meeting Friday during SSR in the gym. You will be discussing an upcoming field. Refreshments will be served. That's all we have for today, guys. For GCTV, I'm Chris Snowy. And I'm Tamia Fair. Have a great day, GC.